has large, basically been coming on as a substitute so far for West Ham. Just played 27 minutes as a substitute so far in a West Ham shirt. And it looks as if we uh, head into the last minute of injury time. She can say that she was on a pitch for a vital win for her West Ham side. Drops out off for Cheka. Mace quick to throw it back onto the pitch. Claudia Walker has gone down uh, just holding her head, uh, having tried to win in that challenge. And uh, she sustained that cut to the left side of her head um, as we headed into added on time at the end of the first half and just uh, picking up a bit of a knock uh, in the last few seconds here at Victoria Road. Up into the sky and down to Svitkova. Shouts of hold it, hold it from the sidelines. And this might be it. Here at Victoria Road, we've uh, played the three minutes of added on time shown by the fourth official. Is there, though, one more opportunity for Birmingham? Mailing's in. Oh, and that's the equaliser in injury time. Here at Victoria Road, West Ham must have thought they had this one. But it's a cross into the box, racing down. On it was Ruby Mace. And she is surrounded by her players who celebrate the equaliser with what must be the last act of this match. The West Ham players cannot believe it. They have got their heads in their hands. But in added on time, in added on time, across from the right hand side, I think Mailing was that player who chipped it in from the right-hand side and racing in on it was Ruby Mace, of all people. A wonderful volley from her, taking it past Courtney Brosnan. And it's West Ham 2, Birmingham City 2. Well, it did look like maybe Birmingham City might just have one more chance in this game when they've taken it. It's now really up to the 